Assalamu alaikum everyone. My name is Valentina Cantori. I am Italian and I was raised Catholic. And now I'm working as an impact fellow on the Mustard Seed Project. And I'm speaking from our partner church in Los Angeles. You might be familiar with the verse on the Mustard Seed in the Quran, but in case you don't know, a similar verse is present also in a biblical passage. And both passages use the metaphor of the mustard seed to remind us that even the smallest act of compassion can bring about invaluable transformation. The Mustard Seed Project is Impact's attempt to fight the rampant political polarization that is eroding the social fabric of our nation, one act of compassion at a time. You might ask, how are we trying to accomplish this seemingly impossible task? Nothing is impossible if we do God's work. With the Master Seed, we are organizing a series of gatherings between Muslims and evangelical Christians across the country. Our goal is inspired by the Quran. O humankind, we have created you from a male and a female and have made you into nations and tribes so that you may know one another. We are building the story of us based on knowing one another, understanding our differences, and celebrating our shared values. As we announced in last year's convention, the Master Seed Project was inspired with seed funding from the late Diane Mott. Having lived in America and Muslim-majority countries for much of her life, she leaves behind a legacy of bridging Muslim and evangelical communities that have traditionally been wary of one another. The Master Seed Project is not your usual interfaith project. We pair a local mosque and a church whose congregants would otherwise not have engaged one another. We invite both communities to break bread, ask uncomfortable questions, and share their experiences in a safe space. And both communities are given the opportunity to tailor their future interactions. In May 2021, as it became safer during COVID, we started piloting this project in Phoenix, Arizona, Costa Mesa, California, and Chicago, Illinois, with enormous success. Let me share with you what wonders the Master Seed generates. Our goal is to decrease the toxic political polarization in our country. One act of compassion at a time. We distribute a survey after each event to gauge the efficacy of our work. 100% of respondents reported benefiting from the encounter. 64% said they had not participated in similar events before, and we have received consistent positive feedback. One Christian participant shared that Master Seed should happen in every church in America. Another said, there was a genuine curiosity to get to know each other and that people stayed in touch after the event, meeting for lunch and dinner and building strong interpersonal bonds. Our best metric of success is seeing local communities continue this work by collaborating on projects based on shared values and priorities. For example, our Chicago communities will work together to help Afghan refugees in the greater Chicago area. In the next two years, we want to transform this project into a national movement for change, mobilizing Muslims and Christians around the country to tell loud and clear a different story about each other, a story of unity and harmony. We want to reach out to evangelical communities in the most conservative parts of the country based on our shared values of peace, compassion, and service. Changing sentiments on the ground can change public opinion and public policy. This is the story of us. A story of us that turns the page on polarization and demonization and starts writing a new chapter of unity, understanding, and compassion for each other. If you believe in this work, Please take a moment to donate now. Click on the donate button near the live stream or visit mpac.org slash donate. Your support will help us make Master Seed a movement for national change. We hope you will contribute to turning the page with us.
Thank you for joining.